Again, it's Priscilla Batzel in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery, and I have an 8 inch round. I think it's a master's touch from Hobby Lobby. An OXO omelet turning flip and fold spatula. Make the residuals go over the edge, which works pretty well. Probably work better if I force some paint into those little crevices. And I'm going to use, after I get rid of the rest of that, some white. Actually, I'm going to wipe that right off on my Lola Fee silicone mat because it makes a great background. It makes a great first layer. This is my Meaden White. And I don't mind leaving a little extra of that in the middle. When I finally get to it, I'm just going to grab a new spatula. We may have to torch because of all those bubbles. I, I can't help myself. I've got to shake my paint. Just the same as I can't help myself. I, I can't waste my paint either. That's pretty good. And I will torch. Just blow it right in. Throw my spatula in the bucket. Grab some paint colors. I think I'm going to start with some Venetian blue. A little bit of Anita's white metallic. Actually, I think it should have been gold. Let's go with the Anita's white metallic that has the Venetian blue like I just used in it. A little dioxazine purple. A little color shifting purple flash from Folk Art. And finish up with some hot orchid. But honestly, and definitely needs to be shaken. Let's do the other side. Start the way I was supposed to. Let's give some Decor Americana 24 karat gold. Some folk art color shifting red. A little bit of this I call it Velveeta. It does want to come out, but not well enough to be helpful. Come on out. That's really unhelpful. Well, bear with me for a moment. I'm not putting up with that today. <laughs> Cross your fingers, we get it. Yes. And I'm going to finish up with Hot Orchid again, because I can. And I'm going to use some Amsterdam Black that has pre-stained wood conditioner in it. My pre-stained wood conditioner added, added Amsterdam Black recipe is Cell Activator is right under the video. have two blooms and I want a third. <laughs> I am going to grab a skewer. I have never wrecked anything like this before and I don't really intend on spinning but I'd like to give it a shot. I've been seeing a lot of people doing it. I actually have a basting brush I have not used for a long time and I think that would be a lot of fun to try.
and I might tip. And why should I not? I'm going to use the dull end of a skewer if I can find one. I'm sure there's one here somewhere. <laughs> Every tool I'm picking up has a Twist the end of that. Throw a few sp spirals in there. I like dipping into the white and getting some white included in the design. Let's see if tipping is going to help. Kind of like it just as it is. Yeah, I like that just as it is. I do want another spiral over here because I can. And I think a few dots won't hurt anything. Matter of fact, I kind of like the idea a lot of throwing a couple dots. I think I might have to wait for them to be dry first though. Yeah, that's not hurting my feelings. I kind of like that. Go back to putting some of the black in there again. I could grab a little dish. kind of want some orange ones in there. Or maybe I'll settle for the red. A little bigger dollop. All right. It occurs to me that I love, love, love this color. Some on there, I might like it even better. Which might mean grabbing a small container like this one. It seems like I have a little bit of black left on there. I'm kind of thinking the um, the hot orchid would be nice on there too. But I really like what I've got and I'm good with it. And if I take this off of the plastic then I can torch it. I didn't spin but it doesn't mean you couldn't if you have the capacity. I'm just not really set up to do that. Yes, once you start the spirals, it's hard to stop. <laughs> Truly. Quick torch, say thank you for the thumbs up. Thank you for sharing my videos. Thank you for watching longer.
Thank you for shopping my Amazon link where if you shop there it's at no other cost to you. My two books are there because I can and unlimited possibilities and the Axo Omelet Turning Flip and Fold Spatula as well as the Princeton Art Tool Catalyst Spatulas which are really good to have. I have like almost all of them. So I, I should zoom in and if I need more dots someplace else if I think that they would work out better for me tomorrow I will do that. I'm going to spin that around because I see a little something in the middle I don't like. <coughs> I really think, excuse me, that I'd like to have some of the hot orchid. Yes, that makes me happy. It does bleed and it probably will bleed into the, just cover up that little black thing. One more. Okay, four more. Okay, I'm going to zoom in like I said I was going to and call it good. I'll tell you guys I love you. Yeah, that's kind of sweet from up here. How close can I get? Not very. All right, that's my first one of these. So I will give it a try again soon. Thank you for the wonderful comments that keep my morale boosted. Thank you for the donations through PayPal and Patreon that keep me painting and buying art supplies. And same thing works for the Amazon link and know what it costs you and it helps me buy art supplies. Uh, if you're interested in my two books, they're Because I Can and Unlimited Possibilities. If you're interested in winning a painting, there's a monthly drawing and you can see the exhibition video that they are, that the prizes are included at the beginning of on the end screen video, which is in the last 20 seconds of every video. If you have questions, feel free to ask. If you're looking for my paint pouring recipe or my cell activator recipe, they are under Show More. Also under Show More is my email address. If you're interested in purchasing an artwork, please inquire using the hashtag and the file number from the title. If you are interested in a class with me privately at the house in Spring Hill, Florida, that's also available. Ah, uh, what else? Pinterest, Instagram, Twitter links on the link tree. The first blue link under the video has my website, Pinterest, Instagram, Twitter links, my Facebook groups, Expressionist Art Studio Gallery Appreciation Group is for students, Expressionist Art Studio Gallery. Totes and more will take you to fineartamericanpixels.com, also on the link tree. And uh, underneath the video is spring clothing, all over print leggings and all over print t-shirts and lots more really cool stuff. And anything you purchase helps support the production of videos and uh, I really appreciate it. On the link tree, Le Gallerist, awesome, awesome investment quality clothing from Montreal dresses and uh, kimono tops and a bunch of other stuff that you will like a lot if you have money to invest in clothing. It's worth having a look at least. I really appreciate you guys being here. Thank you so much. I hope you come again. I have over 2,000 videos and they are organized by the hundred by topic and genre. And if you want to find them, you can either ask me for a link or you can also go to my YouTube channel and look for playlists, all playlists, creative playlists, and you'll find what you're looking for. And if you don't, like I said, please ask me. If you have comments, if you have questions, if you have questions, please ask me. I love you guys. Take care of each other. Take care of yourselves. Bye for now. This is Priscilla Batsell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expression Start Studio Gallery out saying, I love you very much. You inspire the heck out of me. Ollie, we'll see you anon.